Hello! And we are here today with the Stanley Parable demo. Okay, so, oh, I'm Alicia Storm. I forgot to introduce myself. You guys already know that. Anyway, um, how are you? All right, that's good. Uh, I'm doing okay. Uh, okay, so I, I know that I've only uploaded, this is just general stuff. I know I've only uploaded uh, one uh, part to my Gone Home playthrough. I did finish it. Uh, but, uh, Cat for the win still has yet to pay me back for something that I paid her, so I don't have any money to get, um, my better, uh, editing program right now. But hopefully I won't do too much messing up in this demo. Uh, okay, so, the Stanley Parable. Uh, the, I, de I never played the first game, which was a Half-Life 2 mod called the Stanley Parable. Uh, but I, shut up, boo. But I um, did watch somebody play it. So I do know the content of the first game, and I thought it was so awesome. I rewound it and rewatched certain parts numerous times because it was awesome. So this is the demo, and from what I understand, the demo has content that the uh, actual game does not. I will play the actual game, but I think think that the narration in the demo is different because it's a demo. So we're going to go ahead and get right into it. Um, yeah, I put subtitles on. Okay, so here we go. I think I'm going to play this one right through also. So if it's a long video, I do apologize because I do tend to search around for things. I, I like to make sure I don't miss anything. Oh, whoa, whoa. Sorry, I was adjusting my legs. I like how they start you off just looking at a wall. It's kind of eerie. All right, let's see. Oh, we got some music. Aha, ha, I love the music. Stanley Parable demonstration this way. Can I go this way though? Can I get a drink? I'm a little bit thirsty. A dollar twenty-five. That's actually not too terrible, except that they're cans and not bottles. If they're- oh wait, maybe they are bottles. Is there a way to crouch? Nope. Can't- can't do anything but move around. <laughs> it sounds like you're typing when you click. Don't mind me, I'm just typing a paper on the Stanley Parable demo. I'm with the- uh, Stanley Parable Times, and uh, I just wanted to to make a. Uh... Welcome to the Stanley Parable demonstration. Your number is twenty-eight. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Thank you, and have a pleasant demonstration. Okay. Well, I guess I guess my number is displayed. Look at how neatly they put everything. Look at those three little pencils there. Looks like there's a message. Anyway, I'm, uh, I wanted to interview the narrator. Hey! Uh, do not stand on this side of fence. On this, this side, right here, the side that I am currently standing on. Do not stand on this side, so am I supposed to be on that side? What? Oh, I guess we're gonna wait. Hmm, somebody was doing homework. The Stanley Parable Demo. Hmm, I want one of those cups. I don't know, should we wait or should we just go in? What happens if we wait? What happens if we go in? Ah, it's, it's going by pretty fast, actually. Ah, let's just wait. I don't think it'll change. Uh, make make anything different. What if we go in late? Oh, okay, that's not our number, but we're gonna go ahead and go in. <laughs> Famous demos. 
Yes. Yes. Yeah. I'm not sure if I know that one. But yes, anyway. This wallpaper is so... I don't know. I don't know how to describe this wallpaper. I don't know how I feel about it. Alright. Oh, hello, hello, hello. Welcome to the Stanley Parable live demonstration. It will be my pleasure to guide you through this sneak peek at what to expect in the Stanley Parable. A tease. Just enough to leave you hungry for more. How exciting. Can't you just feel that nervous tension? The yes. looming uncertainty? Why don't we drink in the anticipation for a moment, just for 20 minutes or so? Why 20 Please, minutes? for just 20 minutes, don't move or act in any way. Simply remain motionless and let the thrill of demoing the Stanley Parable wash over you. Should we not move? Oh, I get it. You're too anxious. You can barely hold still. Well, tell you what. I think we should walk off that nervous energy before getting the demo underway. All right. Here, why don't I take you on a little tour of the facility oh, that's nifty. and show you how we make a demonstration for a game like the Stanley Parable. So, I thought we were supposed to drink for 20 minutes, not uh, not be motionless for 20 minutes. I wonder what happens if anybody actually does go through This is where I and that. the other proctors have been working meticulously to construct a demo that explains clearly and concisely exactly what the Stanley Parable is, how it plays, and why you should spend real-world money on the main <laughs> game. Video game demonstrations are tricky, and without the proper technology, you run the risk of the player having no idea what to expect in the full version. There's like steam coming out of that door. Oh no, wait, where is that coming from? Well. So it's kind of funny, if you get get the demo or game off Steam, and you watch, there's like a little trailer for it, it's actually quite amusing, I encourage you to watch it. Where's demo admin number zero one, uh, 9? Sorry, not zero 01. Zero 01 is apparently non-existent, who are you? You're zero, yo, you're number 10. Well, you guys are missing an action, so I'm gonna keep going. What time is it? Okay. Is that AM or PM? Well, it's kind of bright, so I guess it's AM. What is the... Uh, I can't see what those say down there. Out of order... Something or other... Uh, office... Uh... Something technology... Buttons and uh, something or other S storage. Oh, that one I. Uh, nope, can't read it. It's not that important. Why are the bars different here? It's a little weird. Laundry? No. I can't read it. I don't have my glasses on, so. Ah, here is one such technology. These buttons are meant to convey the meaning of choice and the impact of the decisions you make. After all, choices carry tremendous meaning and consequence. Didn't you know that? Go ahead. Why don't you try picking one of these buttons to press and we'll see what your choice says about you. One second. I'm just starting that stopwatch that I always seem to forget to start right away. Uh, I want to get that one in that corner right there. Can I go get that one? I wonder if I... Let me see. Nope. Oh, darn. I'm too short. I just cannot reach it. Can we get... How fascinating. Did you know that 94% of all people who select that particular button are sexual predators? <laughs> you see, our choices really do illuminate the very intangible nature of our minds and souls. Oh, this is so great. I'm a psych major, so this is awesome. Oh, come on. <sighs> Sorry, I had to drink some iced tea. Okay, what else can I show you then? This place is the buffalo of game design. Nothing is wasted. Oh, I'm down where... Okay, demo status. Uh, compliments. 
Let's go in compliments. One of the most important parts of administering any demonstration is pumping up your ego and appealing to insecurities about your sense of self-worth. <laughs> That's why we use this room to develop cheap compliments to shower on the player <laughs> during the demo. Cheap Go ahead compliments. and press that button to see some of the superficial flattery we've been cooking up. <laughs> okay, this one. My heavens, I've never met someone who can consume as much uranium in a single sitting as you can. Just look at you go. Oh, that that sounds like it's a very uh, good supplement. That was sarcasm. Of all the people I know who are playing this exact demo at this exact moment and standing in this exact room, your performance is easily in the top 5,000. Okay. Top 4,700 even. I won't go as far as 4,600. Well, thanks. Hmm. Uh, let's see. Oh, this is embarrassing. I really can't think of anything else to say. Uh, no, no. You've really exhausted my list of compliments. <laughs> Goodness, that was fast. Either you or this department has a lot of room for improvement. Okay then, what's next? I think it's your department. I'm awesome, so you, you really, there are thousands of more compliments you can come up with. Uh, wonder why that room is out of our order. No, not final choice. Emotion booths? Let's go to wall technology. Now, I think you'll find this exciting. We've actually developed a wall that you can walk through. Go ahead, give it a shot. Are you gonna make me run into it? Whoa! Oh. Hmm, guess it's still in development. <laughs> right, okay, moving along. Okay, thanks for letting me run into that wall, sir. That was very nice. How's the anticipation? Still feeling it? Uh, oh, that's where we came from, right? Yeah. No, no, we've already seen this room. <laughs> if it saves you the trouble of pushing another button, I can assure you that you're still a pervert. <laughs> uh, that was awesome. Wait, can I, can I push a button? No, okay. Uh-oh. Luna, what are you doing? What are you guys doing? Hmm? Give me one second. I'm just gonna check something real quick. Bad. Okay. Uh -huh. Apologies. It was nothing too urgent. Uh, let's go to demo in progress. This device tells you whether or not you're inside a video game demonstration. Somewhere around here, there's also a device that tells you whether or not you're inside a device that tells you whether or not you're inside a video game demonstration. <laughs> All right. Um. Are you that eager for the demo to start? Don't worry, we're almost there. Is there something inside the boxes? No. Mr. Narrator. How old are you? Let's see, we did compliments. Uh, I guess emotion booths? Now here's what we use to convey story. These booths convert text from a story into raw emotion. Oh. Go ahead, step into one of them and feel the sheer power of narrative exposition. Oh, okay. So... That one's just an emotion booth. That one's happiness. I guess you'll get to these in the full game. Courage. Uh, motion booth, motion booth, motion booth. Man! Now, now, we have to save at least a few emotions for the full game. <laughs> Confusion. Embarrassment. Alright, so do you want to go with despair or discovery? Why is despair green and discovery red? Let's go to despair. Where did these cliffs go? These crags that we stood upon, they shielded us from our own ignorance. 
spoke coddling words and wrapped our vulnerabilities in a woolen cloth that so many times I tried to set aflame. If I knew these comforts now, would their fibers be any more sensitive to the heat of my touch? Perhaps it was the cold I desired most of all. That empress to whom my flesh was always invisible. A hammock for the bones waiting to be touched and to be known. It sounds Shakespearean. And also there were no ti subtitles in that one. I bet these are from like actual old English, not even old English, but some textbooks. It was though and within the shame he carried that ocean breeze did drift. The fierceness of the tides, the inevitable collapse of their kingdoms, <laughs> washed ashore, bereft of shame, Trains. martyrs devoid of a cause, ripping Owning and tearing at the eternal seams. A vessel without a captain, carrying itself like plastic in the wind, hinting at a purpose that was truer in some distant memory, if only it could decipher through time's veneer whose memory it wanted to be. All right, uh, that was interesting. Thanks for showing me that. Oh, you went in both booths? Oh, how vulnerable of you. If at any point during the demo you need to cry, just let me know and we can take a minute. <laughs> What's down here? What is that? Isolation chamber. Important rules for properly administering demonstrations. Get right into get right to gameplay. Give a brief summary of the game's plot rather than the full explanation. Hint at the first boss, but don't give away exactly who it is yet. Make all cutscenes skippable. Demo should it should last exactly eight minutes. Players should not be confused. I think that um, none of those are applied here. Fragile. Art. Yes, it's art! Oh, goodness, they need more art in here. What happens if we go into, into rooms more than one? Oh, I guess not. Nothing. Alright, uh, let's see, we went into that one, went into that one, went to that one, went to that one, went to that one, okay. What? Ah, now this room is perhaps the most important you'll encounter in the demo. This is where we determine whether or not the demo has been effective. No! What are you doing? You can't make that decision yet. You haven't played the demo. We've put so much work into this demonstration. Wouldn't it be a shame if you rushed right into making a purchasing decision without savoring it first? Let this one simmer. You'll have plenty of time to decide later. Thought we only had eight minutes, sir. That actually kind of scared me when they closed it. I was like going slow and then it happened all fast. It was weird. But this is the exit. And there you have it. Everything you need to know about how video game demos are made. Oh. Okay. Oh. I didn't even know that was there. However, it's still important that we address safety concerns. Please closely observe the following possible negative side effects of playing the Stanley Parable. Okay. If you agree to be held 100% responsible for any and all injury or long-term damage, mental, physical or otherwise, that may occur while playing the demo, please do not press the large red glowing disagree button at this time. Wait. Nothing? No objections? You're quite sure about that? Oh, well, all right then. What? In the event that you do experience one or all of the previously listed symptoms, let's establish a signal for you to convey to me that you wish the demonstration to be terminated. Please step into the dance perimeter. <laughs> what? Please perform a dance. Your dance has been recorded. In the event that you feel confused or disoriented by anything you see inside the demo, Perform that dance, and I will terminate the demo immediately. <laughs> that's not even right. a dance, that's like All preparations have been made. It is time 
At last, are you prepared Yay! for the Stanley Parable? Yes, yes I am. Who moved the furniture? Oh goodness. That Oh my god, it's so bright. Okay. What? Oh wait, what? What are we doing Welcome here? Welcome to the Did we Stanley not Parable demonstration. Your number is 29. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Thank you, and have a pleasant demonstration. Uh, narrator? Mr. Narrator? Something's wrong. <laughs> what? Is, it's a leaf. Can you... Hey! Um, okay, uh, I'm lost. Let's just get back to the green room and start the demo again. I must have done something wrong the first time. Okay. I'm glad that you know exactly what's happening right now. But it says 17. I'm not going to I'm not going to wait. Who okay, you know that no one is checking numbers, right? You can just go. You could do it right now, literally right this second. I don't know how no one ever figures this out. We could be back at the demo by this time. Are you Are you enjoying this? Watching numbers tick down slowly. Well, please, don't let me stop you. <laughs> if somehow you're associating the joy of this room with the joy of playing the Stanley Parable, then by, by all means, continue. The full version of the Stanley Parable contains all the ecstasy you are now experiencing and so, so, so much more. <laughs> look, at, look, time has actually gone by. That's, that's awesome. It's, uh, it's been, uh, like 25 minutes. So somebody spilled that cup over. Nobody should, should leave a cup right there. Okay. All right, everything's the same here. That door is gone. All right, let's get this. Okay, uh, here we go. The Stanley Parable demo, take two. Finding the demo, learning exactly what the Stanley Parable is. Here it comes. All right. Oh, wait, what's this? What? What? This isn't it. You closed the door on me. What are you doing? Why is there an eight? Uh. All right, so these, that's okay. Eight. Eight. Wait, 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 wait. It's, this is all wrong. This isn't the Stanley Parable. This is a game where you press a button and it says eight. <laughs> <laughs> not only is the Stanley Parable not a game about continuously pressing the number eight, I can guarantee that this button does not appear anywhere in the main game. Why eight. is it here instead of the demo for the Stanley Parable? Where did the demo go? There was an actual demo here before. Something has gone wrong. It's all gone horribly wrong. We need to get you out of here before you start forming impressions of the Stanley Parable based on whatever the hell this eight game is. We need to get out. We need to start over. Eight. You mustn't stay here another minute. Out, out, out. Go, go, go. Eight. Okay. Imagine if this had been the demo. What would you have been thinking? You'd have left with no idea what the Stanley Parable is about. None whatsoever. <sighs> Sorry, some tea. My throat was getting a little dry. Well, now what? What do you propose I do, Mr. Narrator? Oh, I guess I'm... okay. Oh, shit. Um... Welcome to the yes, Stanley yes, Parable yes, we demonstration. All the first time. Your number is 30. When your number is displayed, please enter the demonstration room. Thank you. 
<laughs> Even the narrator's like, shut up. Now, now, no time for exploration. We've got business to attend to. Okay, okay, I'm going. Okay, now, let's take a minute to get something straight here. When you sit down to play this demo, you are assuming an amount of responsibility for its outcome. Now, I can't say for certain whether you caused us to encounter the eight game rather than the Stanley Parable, but I think it's a pretty safe assumption that you had something to do with it. Uh, At hey. this time, please take a minute to think about all of the mistakes you've made in playing this demonstration, as well as your lack of respect for demo taking in general. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> uh, what did we do? What did we do wrong? What did we do wrong, you guys? Uh, okay. All right. Uh, yeah, that's Wonderful. good enough reason. I could really feel the introspection on my end. Now that we're all on the same page again, I feel ready to attempt the demonstration once more. In this third attempt, we shall truly come to understand the meaning of the Stanley Parable. Let the demonstration begin. All right, let's let's do it, guys. Whoa, whoa, wait, wait a second. Why is I don't, I can't see anything? Uh, whoops. Oh well, I can't jump. All right. Uh. Oh shit! What? No, 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 no! It can't be over yet. You didn't see anything. No. Everything that was supposed to demonstrate why the Stanley Parable is a quality experience worth your time and money. It was here somewhere, I'm sure of it. Oh, no, 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 no. We have to get out of here. We have to find something for you to do, anything. The demo cannot end like this. Ah, hurry, hurry, this way. <laughs> what? Okay, yes. This is new. This is different. Surely there must be a game somewhere in here. Okay, okay. Oh, how about this cup? Yes, go pick up the cup. His uh, subtitles disappeared. Hey, look, spare buttons. Your number is... Red. All right, I guess nothing happens if I don't pick it up. All right, now put it, um, um, in the bin. <laughs> okay, I guess nothing happened. You did it! You won! Do you know what you get <laughs> for winning? An achievement. Woo! Wow, the standard oh my God, I got just it. keeps I actually getting got it. better and better. In fact, let me take a little survey Video of games. experience. Based on what you've played so far, would you purchase the Stanley Parable? You responded, What a clear and straightforward demonstration of the merits of the Stanley Parable. I am convinced of the quality of the full game. Incredible. You really do get it. You understand. Oh, I was so worried. <laughs> I just wanted you to know what I see in the Stanley Parable. What I think makes it... Well, special. It's so very difficult to put into words. <sighs> oh, we're all beyond that now, aren't we? <laughs> Come along. Let's get to the end and the final choice. I I didn't hit any buttons, by the way. I was reading. What ending. The ending. Were. Where are you? Where are you? Disagree. Whoa. Uh, okay. Is this it? Uh yes! The end! Now, this is where we want the demo to be over. And I think it's time for you to log your final decision as to whether or not the Stanley Parable is any good. And it all comes to this. Please consider very carefully before answering. Much is at stake. Alright, let's actually answer this time. Do you like the Stanley Parable? I do, actually. Hey. Is it working? I. Are you sure? You sure you pressed the button? <coughs> what? No, we, we finished the demo. Did it start again? Hello? Is anyone there? They already finished. They said they liked it. I need someone to stop the demo. Hello? <laughs> we need to go back. We need to get out of here. 
A sense of urgency is real, you guys! <laughs> Whoa, why is everything red? What oh, happened? Oh no, what's going on? Where is everyone? Okay, over to the left, down this way. You know, I can't see you. Like the Stanley Parable. I'm stuck. Oh my god, I think it's getting louder. Wait, what's around here? Is there anything here? No. Oh, oops. Can't go that way. Alright, alright, I'm going in. Make the sounds up! Thank you. Oh, nice and quiet. Finally. Yes. Well, I suppose we can both agree that I failed, haven't I? My job was to be a teacher. And I so badly wanted to teach you exactly what the Stanley Parable is supposed to be, but but somehow I couldn't. I, uh, well, at any rate, Aww. I don't know if I care for the Stanley Parable anymore. Aw, don't say that. Do you think any of this is actually in the main game? No. Honestly, I doubt it. What would that even look like? No, I think I've had enough of it. Aw, don't... No more doors, no more demonstrations, no more endings. That's Mr. the other Narrator. problem with this game. There's too many bloody endings. I'm sick of them. How can one game end so many times? It doesn't make sense. Oh, but back at the beginning of the demonstration, now oh, that was lovely. No concerns about where it was all going. No confusion. Just a blank slate. Yes, that's what I want. A game of beginnings. I guess hey. that's what it's going to be. <laughs> Do you remember, just a few minutes ago, when we met for the first time, and I showed you the technology used to make Whoa. the demo because I thought there actually was a demo. <laughs> oh, we were so naive back then. How little <laughs> we knew of the world. And He's... then when we ended up back in the waiting room, even uh. though you'd already done that before. Yes, it's all so fresh in my memory. They were such wonderful moments. <laughs> oh. And then when we played the game with the cup and you won, and then we kept wandering and we ended up in a stairwell somewhere, and no, we just we kept climbing and climbing, flight after flight after flight. I thought they would never end. And then we were on some kind of catwalk. What? I didn't have any idea what was down there. Did you? What the fuck is happening? And we just kept going and we found that elevator and it no, said no, escape this, on it. No, this didn't happen. We talked about it for a while about how we couldn't possibly know whether this was really an escape, but that it seemed worth a try, and at the very least it would be an adventure. So we got inside and what? we rode the elevator up and up and up. No, this we didn't happen! That the end was coming, but we couldn't possibly know when, and then after so long it finally stopped, and we stepped out into the lush outdoors, the trees, the wildlife, the sun rising on a new and glorious path. Freedom. We were free. There was nothing to think. Nothing what? to know. Simply what are you talking about? Being right there in that moment. Wasn't it so beautiful? Mr. Narrator, I love you. Wasn't that moment so singularly, piercingly beautiful? You have a way with words. We were free. Are, are you crying? What is happening? What the fuck? Where am I now? I hear people, but I don't see them. Oh shit, what? What's happening? What? What? Oh my god, is that the end? <laughs> Holy fuck! I don't understand! Um, I don't get it! Oh my god, that was... That was really good, actually. I liked that. Okay, thank you for watching. That was awesome. I'm definitely gonna start playing the Stanley Parable... Um, the, the real one next. So, uh... Wow. <laughs> Alright, uh... Thank you for watching. Uh, th this was awesome. Uh, Alright, I will see you guys later. Bye!